Hey everybody, hope you can see me. Oh boy, sunlight, backlight. Ooh, there he goes. That's a little better. Back on my thing. So, got something today. Um, wanted to show you. Um, you may have seen my videos on uh, Instagram the other day. Just with the rain we've had all week, uh, go all night, that the weeds have gotten a little bit out of control. So, I got me a product here I want to show you uh, that I'm going to try that comes recommended. So, let me show you what it is. I got the BioVance 3 in 1 Weed and Feed for Southern Laws. Laws. Lawns. Not Southern Laws. Should be against law. Um, but this kills weeds, including dollar weed, dandelion, and clover. It's definitely what I'm getting taken over. We got uh, feeds greens and strengthens your law, then it prevents. So this is a pre emergent, a fertilizer, and a post emergent product all in one. Get it three in one, three in one, weed and feed. So I'm going to lay this down up here in the very front, um, up by the sidewalk and by the street. Um, I went to the 12 and a half pound bag, which uh, treats up to 5,000 square feet. So that would do front and back. Um, so the, uh, roughly 12 and a half pounds, 5,000 square feet. So being that we want to lay down roughly around 1,000 square feet, that's two and a half pounds per thousand square feet. So two and a half times five, 12 and a half pounds, 5,000 square feet. Hopefully that makes sense. The thing we've got to remember is uh, I think about it in thousand square feet, but up in front, I've only got roughly 250 square feet to round it up there. I want to make sure I have enough product to go around. So what that means is uh, where it's two and a half pounds for a thousand square feet, half of that would be one and a quarter pound. So that means we're going to be going about six tenths of a pound, uh, 0.6 pounds uh, for the, the 250 square feet up in front. So that's what I'm going to measure out here. I've got scale. I've got, I'm going to dump into the old oats box here. Uh, it's not showing any weight. So that means that it'll be a fresh pour. Got my gloves on for being that this is fertilizer. This is a seed. I want to make sure I've got some protection on. So that's what we're going to be doing here. And then I'm going to lay down the Scott's edge guard uh, up there in front. So we'll show you that. Okay, everybody. Got that down. Woo Wind blowing. I'm supposed to get this. Look at this. I'm getting some mud flats back here. I got a haircut finally scheduled for Tuesday uh, at a new place, Chop Riverside in downtown Jacksonville. So uh, I'm looking forward to that. Testing that out see what it's like. Uh, but let me show you this. Let me show you the actual product. Let me make sure I can do this. Oh, I just took a picture. Hey, hang on. So this is the product. These are the prills. See how tiny they are. Uh, for the Scotch uh, edge guard, for the spreader is at four and three quarters, which seem to be good enough. Um, I'll head up here real quick. So this is the test area I did. I said this is about two. This is uh, round off to 250 square feet. So just under a pound of product is what I put out here. Um, you have to put it on dry grass or pre-dawn or, you know, dew, pre-dew, a little bit of wetness. But I just did a pass down, I'm going both ways, which seemed to cover everything, uh, spread all the way through. So I'm just hoping to really try to, especially this clover and everything that's in here, try to get it wasted. Uh, before I move on to the bigger areas with that smaller area we're going to, have to watch out for the ducks and everything um, and yes still got to work on this uh, work on the uh, driveway got another new product for that I'm going to try out which is wet and forget that's that blue bottle over there if you guys have ever tried that in your own house let me know I want to know how it's worked for you guys um, but uh, it's still where I'm looking to do over here if it does well enough in that front I'll, I'll bring the uh, three and one to this side as well product update so I wanted to show you guys today um, I'll have a review I'll check back hopefully in a week because uh, that's about says about how long it takes uh, like I said I can't have the animals on it so I gotta watch out for the ducks can't wet it for 24 hours wow look at that backlight can you see me now hey look at that hey so um, 24 hours I'll, I might throw a web but we are expecting rain tomorrow so we'll see what happens with that hopefully we'll get the rain so I don't have to do the water um, this past week thankfully we've gotten a lot of rain so it's definitely helped out the grass had to mow it yesterday um, I do have to get into the backyard but it's so high right now I'm going to raise up the uh, the mower and I can already tell eh, my neighbor's yard is already getting high again so um, 
that's it for right now. Just a quick review, letting you know what I'm doing. Uh, hump, being that this is a pre-emergent, post-emergent, and fertilizer, hopefully it will help with what's already growing weed-wise, prevent what will grow, and still give some, uh, some feed to the lawn. So thanks, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe. Uh, check me out on the YouTube channel. This will probably come up on the Instagram. We'll see. I'm not sure which one, but make sure. Either way, like, subscribe here on YouTube. I'm going to post on YouTube. And then check out my Instagram, still Raised by Nerds. And then also uh, Twitter, Raised by Nerds. Look me up. Thanks a lot.